Hi everybody, it's Faith from Fire Santero. Hope everyone is well. I apologize, the work week top and bottom of the deck is coming about 24 hours behind. I had every intention of being home on time on Sunday, getting out of work on time, coming home, throwing dinner in the oven, coming back, doing the top and bottom of the deck reading for the week, having dinner with the boys, chilling out, having family time at home, getting a little bit of housework done, going to bed early, it didn't work out that way. I ended up having to travel for my job last night and I didn't get home till about two and a half hours after I was supposed to be home. The guys ended up having to eat leftovers. It's like, I'm sorry, <laughs> you know, life happens. This is how we pay the bills. So, you know, I can't, I can't, <laughs> I can't avoid it sometimes. It is part of my job. So that being said, we're here now and we're going to throw them down because last night I was just way too, it was car gibberish and crickets when I sat down to try to read. Nothing made sense. So it's like, I need to go to bed. We'll try again tomorrow night. So we're here. We're doing it. For those of you who are new here and don't know how we do this, I go by the elements. It just makes for a faster read. I'm not sitting here rambling. So if it resonates with your sun sign, cool. It's your free will to do whatever you choose to do with the message given by the cards. If you choose to do anything at all, it is your journey, not mine. I'm just throwing down cards. If it doesn't resonate, that's okay. You can check your moon rising, your Venus sign readings. Just keep in mind, time and energy are both fluid and all things can and maybe vice versa. If you're not sure where your sun sign falls as far as the elements go, I do shout out the signs as I'm going through the decks. And usually, um, if you're catching the playback, somebody's kind enough to timestamp it. So, <clears throat> you, you know where, you know, the different elements begin in the reading and you don't have to sit through the whole thing unless you want to. I mean, I don't mind if people sit through the whole thing. If you love me that much and want to sit and watch me ramble, that's cool. <laughs> But, yeah. Mm. Emperor Reverse came out for the Earth signs. That's interesting. One more quick reminder before we throw it down. Um, if it's not your message, leave the cards on the table and walk away. Don't take what doesn't belong to you because sometimes that's how fights get started and I don't want to be accused of being a homewrecker again this week. So, okay. Earth signs, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Let's get them on the table for you. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, January, we'll say the 11th through the 14th. Why not? Okay. Six of Wands reversed, Ace of Pentacles reversed. <clears throat> wow. Wow. That didn't work out too good, did it? I don't think so. I'm feeling like... Uh, wow. Back porch. Somebody's return was not welcome. I don't know if it was your return, Earthstein friends, or someone returning to your life, but... That long ago planted seed still ain't growing, and if they try to make a comeback, they, they weren't welcome when they came to the door, were they? Let's find out what happened. Ten of Swords reversed, world reversed. This still hurts. This is two cards of a cycle not coming to an end right here. Wow. Oh, man. I don't think you're letting it end, or they're not letting it end. The sun is not shining. It is not coming to an end. Oof. We'll throw a clarifier on that in a minute. It could be because there's unfinished business, but... Devil reversed. Six of Pentacles. Releasing yourself. From something that was very binding, possibly something that was very toxic. Still in the process of releasing yourself, going towards something possibly a little bit more equal, a little bit more balanced with the Six of Pentacles. Could be a Capricorn or another Earth sign you're dealing with. Could be an air sign, might be a fire sign. Hmm. I don't know. It's coming in for you this week. Hangman reversed, King of Cups reversed. 
I'm still struggling with it. How can you still be struggling with it and not accepting of the fate of the situation still emotionally hung up and emotionally closed off at the same time? Are you trying to suppress it? Let's throw some clarifiers on this. Wow. Okay. Universe, source, and spirit. Can I get some clarity in the cards on the table for my earth sign friends, please? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Holy cow. They're trying... They're excited. They're trying to, like, flip out and talk. <clears throat> Two of Pentacles, Ace of Wands. We'll see if they come back out. Like, pick me! Pick me! <laughs> hands are freaking out. You know what? We're just going to free shuffle this. Eight of swords. Still hung up. You know it's all in your head, right? If you look real close, I'm going to get this as close to the camera as I can. Can, can you see that? Your feet aren't bound. Your feet aren't bound. Just just your arms and, and, and your eyes. You might not be able to see things clearly. You, you may have the chains around you so you don't feel it. You can walk out of that anytime you want. Anytime you want. Ace of Cups. Possibly somebody's trying to hand you a cup, but you're still hung up on something else. Or somebody tried to come back handing you a cup, one of the two. That, that's something new, though. That's screaming something new. <clears throat> You may be emotionally closing yourself off to something new because you're still carrying around your old baggage because you're still all wrapped up in something else. Walk out of it anytime you want. Can I get one on this Ten of Swords reverse, world reverse, please? Just one, just one, just one. Okay, give me two. Five of swords. Sun reversed. Sun is not shining. The sun was not shining. Disconnecting a soulmate union. Five of swords. Open-ended card. It's in the upright, so it doesn't necessarily mean, like, things going on behind your back or things happening in the shadows. It's losing the... Winning the battle to lose the war, if you will. It's picking up the pieces after the battle. You're not over this yet, or you weren't over it at the time. It's an open-ended past. It could have been quite a while ago. It could have been last week. I don't know. You're not over it. Sun wasn't shining. Fast forward a little bit. Devil reversed. Six of Pentacles. Why? Why the devil reversed in the Six of Pentacles? Give me one, give me two. I love it when they do that. I really do. Chariot. <clears throat> Possibly trying to put some distance in there. Could be a cancer you're dealing with. Doesn't necessarily have to be. Some of you may be being pulled in two different directions just because of the picture on the card. The black horse is trying to go one way. The white horse is trying to go another I'm feeling distance, though, for a majority of you. I'm trying to walk away from it. I'm trying to not be bound by it anymore. Emotionally distancing yourself from it. Why the Six of Pentacles? Just the Six of Pentacles.
I like it. Two of Cups. That's new. Something more fair and more equal. This person could be very giving, possibly another earth sign, possibly a water sign. It's coming in this week. Oh, that's iffy. Why the hanged man reverse? Why the hanged man reverse? I don't like it. It gave me three. Well, that, that's, that's a ray of sunshine. Wheel of Fortune, Ace of Swords, Six of Swords. Okay. <clears throat> that's an upward turn of events. Could be any fixed sign you're dealing with. So, Leo. Scorpio. Taurus. Aquarius? Yeah. I just stop and think. It takes a second for me sometimes. I don't have the cheater board anymore. I have no idea what box it ended up in when we packed stuff, so. <sighs> wow. Six of Swords, I see you moving forward. Moving on, moving away. Trying to distance your thoughts from it, starting a new thought process, but I see you trying with this new person. But then there's that King of Cups reversed. Why the King of Cups reversed? Hi. Nine of Cups reversed. That's a mood. It really is. That's a mood. One more. I don't see you taking the cup. Hermit. Okay. Fine. I don't blame you. You're still healing. But, at the very least, you may be closing yourself off to it right now because you're not quite through that last cycle. You're still healing. I don't think you're, like, totally dismissing the new cup, but you're not ready to take it. Okay, well, what do you do? What do you do? Princess of Cups reversed, Five of Swords reversed. If the time isn't right, the time isn't right. If you're not ready, you're not ready. Don't force it. Because if you haven't picked up the pieces of the last one yet, it's going to be the same old situation again. That's what I'm feeling compelled to tell you. If you're not ready, you're not ready. If it's not time yet, it's not time yet. Star reversed. Knight of Wands reversed. Do not move forward if you have not healed. 
don't throw a band-aid on it. Does that make sense? Earth sign friends? It's what I got for you this week. So let me know if it resonates. It might, it might not. Pretty general. I don't think that was very case specific. Every once in a while, I swear the universe just throws stuff at me that's for maybe a couple of people. <laughs> it's like, I don't know who this is for, but if it's your story, let me know. And then I get an email. And sometimes it's some of the most off the wall stuff that I think not in a million years is somebody going to resonate with this. And then I get like five emails. Okay. I don't question it. I just run with it. Anyway. Air signs, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. January 11th through the 15th. King of Swords reverse popped out. We'll see if it comes back out. Somebody maybe being a little bit emotional and making emotion-based decisions. Leading with your heart instead of your head. And... Hierophant reverse, high priest to separate. Oof. Could be a divorce for some of you. Be a Taurus you're dealing with, possibly a Gemini, maybe. Hmm. Wow. Okay. Intuition. Hmm. Someone going with their gut on a situation. That's all I'm hearing. They went with their gut. They went with their gut. Okay. Okay. I don't question it. What happened? Devil reversed in the Six of Pentacles. Wow. Okay. Didn't my air sign... It wasn't in the past line, but didn't my... Didn't my earth signs just get this... Weird. Maybe you're dealing with an earth sign. Or you were dealing with an earth sign. Hmm. Releasing yourself from something that's very binding, potentially toxic. You moved towards something that was more equal. Hmm. Could be a Capricorn you're dealing with. Hmm. Okay. Fast forward a little. Will of Fortune reversed. Oh my. Knave of Chalices, the Knave of Cups. Possibly an apology. Released yourself from it. Went towards something that was more equal. Somebody came in possibly. Could have been a return, possibly an apology. Okay, it's coming in this week. Ooh, six of cups reversed and the emperor reversed. Okay, well, that's interesting. Let's get some clarity. Ooh, salty feelings. I wonder what the Emperor Reversed is all about. Salty feelings possibly stealing somebody's thunder, maybe. Uh, 
chaos. The way this return could be kicking things a little bit out of control. Universe, Source, and Spirit. Can I get some clarity in the cards on the table for my air side? Friends, please. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Huh. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. January 11th through the 15th. Could be Leo. And sometimes it takes a great deal of courage to follow your intuition. That's what's going on right now. Page of Pentacles. Deep connection, small offers. Sometimes it even takes a great deal of courage to apologize to someone. I'm just going to ask one by one on this one. Why the devil reversed? Eight of Pentacles reversed. It was toxic. It wasn't doing anybody any good. Stop putting the energy into it. Stop putting the work into it. Why the Six of Pentacles? Temperance. Either you move towards something where the energy flow is more positive, you move toward the sunshine, you allow the storms to end and the rainbows to come out. Or No, there is no ore. I'm seeing that's what happened. Energy's leveled off. Things became less toxic. The storm ended. The rainbows came out. Energy flow improved. Somebody could have exercised patience. Sometimes it takes courage to have patience. Hmm. Huh. Okay. Not quite sure where that came from, but we're going to go with it. Why the Wheel of Fortune reversed? Chariot reversed. That's a second car to return, friends. Yeah, uh, I, I see things are a little bit more positive now. We're getting along a little bit better. I thought maybe I would stop by, offer you this little fish in this cup I got. <laughs> Why the page of cups? I was just in the neighborhood and to a sword reversed. I don't think... Okay, if you're the one coming in with the apology, I think you had made it... Had a very hard time making this very difficult choice to approach. Or whoever you're dealing with had a very hard time making a very difficult decision to apologize. Hmm. Yeah, I, I dare say that the energy flow was that bad for that long. Okay. <sighs> Oof. I'm thinking in coming this week. I, I, I don't see you. 
air signs, I don't see you accepting an apology if you're the one trying to be given one. <laughs> or if you're the one giving the apology for whatever, it's, all things can be vice versa. I don't see this going well this week. Long or the short of it. Why the Six of Cups reversed? Seven of Swords. They left a salty taste in your mouth. Possibly there was lies and deception involved. Yeah, yeah, yeah. One more. One more on that. Just one. Tower reversed. Somebody's coming in trying to rebuild a tower. Why the Emperor reversed? Six of Swords. Still in the thunder. You've already moved on, or they've already moved on. Somebody's already moved on with this. Somebody's going to steal the other person's thunder. This is my life, this is my choice, and I am choosing to go <laughs> to where the grass is greener and where things are happier and where the energy flow is more positive and I don't have to deal with your storm anymore. That's what I'm seeing. That's what I'm seeing. Let's get your advice, air signs. What do you do with this? Three of Wands reversed in the Justice. King of Pentacles, Empress reversed. Don't wait. Don't let them impede on your path. Don't let them mess your balance up. And don't wait around for things to truly, honestly change. There was lies and deception involved here. I mean, do what you're going to do. If you believe that their apology is wholehearted and honest and they're coming in with the purest intentions, by all means, it's your journey. Do what you want. I don't think their intentions are so pure, though. Don't invest in things that are not going to grow. Do not invest in things that are not in your best interests. Three of Pentacles, upright, Ace of Wands, reversed. Make sure the foundation's there before you move forward.
Ten of Cups reversed and the Wheel of Fortune in the upright. Don't repeat an unhappy cycle. But it's up to you. Do whatever you're going to do. All right, air signs. Let me know if it resonated. That was a wallop. Wow. <sighs> that made my head hurt. Okay. Do, 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 do. Water signs. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, January 11th through the 15th. The 15th to the 14th. What's Friday? Now I gotta stop and think. You know, I'm just going to go with the 15th. If Saturday happens to be the 15th, well, you're covered. Okay. We'll just run with it. I think I've been saying the 15th the whole time, so. Whatever. Okay, water signs. Ten of cups. Four of swords reversed. You're happy, but you're restless. You're happy and you don't want to lay something to rest. Something brought you happiness and you don't want to lay it to rest. What happened? Oh, oh boy. Full reversed, four of wands reversed. Something brought down a little mini tower. Fast forward a little bit. Five of Cups reversed. King of Swords reversed. What's happening this week? Wheel of Fortune reversed. Three of Swords reversed. Oh, man. Okay. Oh, man. Water signs. What's going on? The full reversed is a lack of trust. Somebody not wanting to jump into a situation, possibly dealing with a childish person. Could have been an Aries, just saying, not pointing fingers. I got a little bit of everybody on the board at this point. Take that bath. I don't have Earth. The only Earth I have is um, Taurus with the Wheel of Fortune. Got some fire. And I got some water and I got some air. Hmm. Weird. Okay. Hmm. Universe, Source, and Spirit, can I get some clarity in the cards and symbols for my water sign friends, please? Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, January 11th through the 15th. Super weird. Okay. Over this for a second. Possible lack of trust, possible childish person. The tower came down. The four ones reversed is like my minor arcana tower. Not wanting to bring something to an end. You were happy, or maybe that's why you don't want it to end. Five of Cups reversed, King of Swords reversed. Trying to come out of a state of sadness, possibly, but can't make a non-emotional choice or you're making emotion based decisions possible return bringing you out of a state of heartbreak this week
don't mark it on your calendar, but I'm pretty sure pre-shadow for Mercury retrograde starts on the 15th. Don't mark it on the calendar. Look it up. It's all over the place. All you got to do is pop Mercury retrograde into your phone or Mercury retrograde 2021 and there's articles. I just can't remember exact dates because I read the article like a week ago. But I'm pretty sure pre-shadow starts on the 15th. So that might explain some returns. I don't know. I don't know. Weird stuff happens during Mercury retrograde, guys. Your stuff breaks. People walk back into your life you thought you'd never see again. It's just, it's crazy stuff. Let me tell you. Hmm. Okay. Let's get some clarity before I start rambling again. And this is like an hour long video. Hmm. Oh, I already shuffled. Seven of Pentacles. It brought you happiness. You didn't want to lay it to rest. You waited it out. You were very patient. Will this grow? Will something come out of this? Oh, wow. Why the fool reversed? Death reversed. Love it when that happens. Get back in there. I dropped you. Sticky fingers. You didn't want to jump. They didn't want to jump. Not wanting something to end for something new to begin. Didn't want to jump. One more. Why the death reversed? Lovers upright, magician reversed the hermit. Oh, wow. That's a whole lot of majors in one swap. Just saying. Somebody may not have wanted to jump because lover's card and they could have still been hung up on somebody else or you were. Hermit, somebody could have still been healing from something. That's why they didn't want to jump. Why the magician reversed? sneaky stuff. That's where the left. I, I love it when the story splits off and can go three or four different ways, but I hate it at the same time because I just sit here longer having to explain stuff. For some of you, you couldn't, there was no trust and there was manipulation and there was sneaky stuff going on, which can also lead into the, somebody had a choice between two possibly someone was still healing from something because this happened to them. Take it however resonates if it's your story. I have like tons of stuff hitting me all at once, by the way. <laughs> when, my, when my intuition's on like high mode and I'm sitting here reading the cards and the universe is throwing it at me at like 90 miles an hour and the ancestors are sitting here and they're trying to tell me stuff, it's, it's like a radio signal that can't quite catch. <laughs> know what I'm saying? It's like, I hear it and I sense it, but it's like, okay, what message am I trying to convey here? Because they're all just hitting me at once. Why the four of wands reversed? It 
it landed sideways. Queen of Pentacles. We're going to take her in the upright. She has a catch, isn't she? One more. Either they didn't feel worthy of you or you didn't feel worthy of them. That's what I'm catching. Somebody got very wrapped up in the person they were dealing with. It's almost like a paranoia. I'm sensing a paranoia that the house is going to come tumbling down because I'm not good enough. Wow. Which also for me... <sighs> leads back into the healing and the lack of trust and waiting it out. I was happy. I didn't want to let this go. Moving on, fast forward. Why the five of cups reversed? Coming out of a state of sadness, but not moving forward either. One more. Not giving to it, not taking from it, not moving forward. Just coming out of the state of sadness. Stagnant. Why the King of Swords reversed? So one's reversed, page of cups. <sighs> Hesitation. They want to say it, but they can't. Swords represent communication. They want to say it, but something's stopping them. Something's hindering them. They can't. One more. High Priest. This is divine. This is blessed. And they know it, but they can't move on it. Wheel of Fortune. Possibly... can also represent the start of a cycle. Oof. Oof, water signs. I don't know who you're dealing with, but oof. Three swords reversed. It came flying out. I hadn't asked the question yet. I'm going to set it up here. 
someone's patiently waiting to unbreak your heart. Why is Tony Braxton playing in my head? <laughs> I don't know. That's my dad. When the songs start playing, I know that's my dad. It's like a jukebox up here right now. Why the Wheel of Fortune reversed? Knight of Cups. <laughs> Page of Cups, Knight of Cups. They're coming in. Mm. It's up to you what you do with it, Water Signs, but it's looking like somebody is going to come in and try to unbreak that heart this week. Knight of Pentacles, that's two knights. Could be the same person, could be two different people. I don't know, I wasn't there. Maybe you were the one who had a choice between two. I don't know. I wasn't there. Why the three swords reversed? Six of swords. You may well tell him that... Uh, or pentacles reversed. You may well tell him that you've done released this and you've unbroken your own heart and you've already gone to the other side of the lake and where the grass is greener and you're good and you've done processed it. I don't know. Maybe this is going to be the kicker to where you go process it. I don't know. I see a return coming though. Let's get some advice, because this just got deep, y'all. Wow. What are you going to do with it? Ten of Swords. Page of Cups. There's that old Page of Cups again. It's up to you what you do with it. If the painful cycle has ended for you, and they come back with that cup, it's up to, do, up to you what you do with it. They want to come for your cup again? Let them. You don't want to let them? Don't. It's up to you. If the sun is shining in your world, by all means, allow it to shine on. Three of Wands, Page of Swords reversed. Wait before you engage. Okay. I'm here is wait before you engage. Oh, wait before you instigate. Okay. Wait for them to initiate conversation first, maybe? For some of you, it may be time to just dis disconnect from this altogether and go off on new adventures, new things. Three of Cups reversed in the full. Ten of Wands reversed, Ace of Cups in the upright. Mmm. Ultimately, if the cycle of pain is not ended and the burden is still there and there's still things you need to release, it may not be time to take on a new cup. Because what happens when we fail to end chapters before new ones begin? What happens? You're on that same emotional merry-go-round with different people every time. So... It's up to you what you do with it, Water Signs. I'm just throwing down cards. <sighs> wow. I'm getting like sinus pressure. 
like major sinus pressure right here. I think I just drug my body out way too bad. I, I, I counted the hours. I got like 31 hours of sleep in seven days. <laughs> I did. It's like, um, 31 hours of sleep in seven days. I'm not that great at math, but I know that is not enough sleep. Yeah. It wasn't one of my more brilliant ideas, I guess. So, <sighs> okay. Fire signs. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. What's going on with my fire signs this coming week? January 11th through the 15th. King of Pentacles, Nine of Swords. Why are you all up in your head about being good enough for somebody? Why is being good enough for somebody keeping you up at night? I mean, yeah, he's the cat. She's, he's the embodiment of abundance and everything you want in a dude right there. He really is. He's a provider. He's got his crap together. I'm just hearing that you're all up in your head about being good enough for this person. Could be an earth sign you're dealing with or an air sign. What happened? Four of Cups in the Tower. Oh. Mm. It takes a second for things to become clear. Not seeing the cup that was handed to you or not seeing the cup that was handed to them. They didn't see the cup. Somebody didn't see a cup and it brought a tower down. Could have destroyed a relation. Oh, could have destroyed a relationship. I'm hearing it, a relationship got destroyed. Oh, okay. Okay, fast forward a little. Chariot and the Empress. Moving forward, distance. Huh. Someone finally became the Empress? I'm hearing someone finally became the Empress. What's well, coming in next week? Strength reverse, Ten of Cups reverse. <laughs> I hold back. Can I get some clarity in the cards and take it for my fire sign, friends, please? Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. No, I'm going to move that out of the way. There we go. We'll come back to that later. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Clarity for Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, January 11th to the 15th, 2021.
Ten of Wands reversed. Never got it off your chest. One more. Ace of Swords reversed. You never told him. I I think you're dealing with someone. You never told him how they how you felt. Or what you thought. There's something... Something you never got off your chest. It feels emotional, but I don't see any cups. Hmm. It could have had something to do with feeling like you couldn't measure up, but I think that's like a, that could be a very case by case scenario for somebody who needed to hear it. I don't know, but just generally somebody never got something off their chest. Somebody never said something and it's slowly eaten away at them. Okay. Why the four cups? Knight of Cups reversed. You didn't take the cup or they didn't take the cup. Somebody didn't take a cup, a cup that was offered. Cup that was off. If I could make words work right now, oh my God, a cup that was offered and take an offer leading to a tower. Why the tower? Why the tower? Three of Cups reversed. Breakdown of a friendship, possibly a relationship. Could have been a family matter. It's a love reading. If it's a family matter, pick it up. I don't know. Breakdown in a relationship, nonetheless. Could have been the breakdown of a friendship. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Let me know if that part resonated. Let's fast forward a little bit. Why the chariot? Two of swords, page of cups. Hmm. Could have been an accum... That two of swords. Not no... Do I say something? Do I not say something? That page of cups, it, it's an off... Possibly an apology, but a small offer. It could be a do I offer the cup again... Could be the other person. Do I finally return the cup? Six of Pentacles, even. Do I finally return the cup? It was a difficult decision. I think a lot of time went by here. 
I think this has eaten away at someone for a while. Wow. Because they, they see the Empress. They see potential. They see what could be. The wondrous, wonderful things that could be. Why the Empress? Death. One more. Let's put that where it goes, right there. One more. The Empress again. She came out again. Somebody evolved here. Somebody evolved. Wow. Feelings have changed. I throw another one on that. They see the empress that you have become, fire signs. Never mind the sex of the card. It's the energy coming off of it. Right, you flipped this for fortune. They want to begin a new cycle. They see that the old cycle has ended. The new cycle has begun. They want their empress. Wow. Is that a you do? I mean, take it however it resonates. Wow. Something they never told you. Something they never told you. Possibly they felt like they didn't measure up or you felt like you didn't measure up. Take it however it resonates. Because they didn't take the cup. Somebody felt like they weren't good enough because the other person didn't take the cup. Now all of a sudden, the other person, or you, all things being fair and vice versa, it's really hard to say who did what. Somebody's coming back with a cup. Fast forward into this week. Strength reversed. Why the strength reversed? Eight of Pentacles reversed. Fire signs. Holding back, not putting the energy into it. What? One more. Two of Cups, you moved on. Why the Ten of Cups reversed? Fire signs, I think this is you who was made to feel like you weren't good enough. I think it dissolved a relationship, possibly a friendship. And I think then somebody at some point, fast forward in time, time is fluid, it's whatever, finally had the aha moment and then, um, oops, too little too late. Finally saw you for the empress that you are. See that you have evolved. I think you always were the Empress, but they finally, you know, the light bulb finally flicked on. And coming up this week, it may be too little too late. Seven of Swords reversed. Finally coming in with that truth, but you've moved on. You're not going to put energy into this shoot because you've moved on. Why the Ten of Cups reversed? Temperance. The storm passed. The sun is shining in your world again. There's rainbows. There's positive energy flow.
Nine of Cups reverse comes out. And I'm hearing, unfortunately, I have to kick your cups over, but I've already moved on to something new because you didn't see me for the Empress I was back then. That's what I'm hearing. I'm not trying to lift myself up. I just, I say it as I hear it. Fire signs. Too little, too late. Wow. Wow. Hmm. Okay. Let's get some advice. I mean, I can totally hear a fire sign being like, you know what? Um, if it took you this long to figure it out, um, I'm just done not interested anymore because I've moved on. I don't, however, see a fire sign being so totally unforgiving that they wouldn't at least sit down for like, I don't know, a cup of tea or a chat or, <laughs> I mean, we're grudge holders, especially Sagittarians, but I guess it depends on how much time has gone by. All right, let's get some advice. Hermit reversed, Queen of Pentacles reversed. Wow. Nine of Wands upright, Ace of Pentacles upright. Don't put your head in the sand and ignore this because you feel like you're not worthy. Because you are. You're the freaking empress. Don't ever think that you're not worthy. Because you are. Absolutely you are. Nine of Wands upright. Ace of Pentacles. If you feel so inclined and want to give it one last try, one last push. Um, if you're in that situation, I mean, if the means are there, if the ability is there, and you want to make this old seed finally grow, by all means, do so. But don't ever think for one second that you're not worthy. Ten of Cups reversed in the moon. For some of you, for some of you, it may be a timing thing. For some of you, it may just be time to release this and let this go and not allow this return to happen. And the question is not why. You may never get an answer. I'm just hearing you may never get an answer. Okay, guys, I'm getting drained. So let me know if it resonated. Let me know if something didn't make sense because there's parts of, especially this one that didn't just, just didn't quite make sense to me. I know I'm a little off my game this week. Okay. Anyway, I love you guys. Um, but it's time for this old lady to get to bed because I got to read cards tomorrow an adult and pay bills and go grocery shopping and do my Tuesday thing. Mostly reading cards though, but I love you. Be blessed. Have fun. Have a good week. And I will catch you guys um, either Thursday night or Friday morning for your weekend top and bottom of the deck. I love you. Have a great week and I'll catch you later.